All right, welcome to our fourth class of our continuing wellness education uh, series. Uh, I am Marcella and I'm going to be bringing you guys the information tonight that we're sharing and I'm super excited to share all of this with you all because um, I think there'll be something in here for everybody today. There's just a little bit of every, like just a little bit for everybody. So it's going to be perfect. I think you guys are going to enjoy it. Um, just a little bit of housekeeping. I'm going to share my screen and share some stuff with you guys. Um, hold on one second. Okay. All right. All right, can everyone see the PowerPoint? <laughs> Perfect, great. All right, so just um, in case you guys haven't um, commented before on your mobile phone, just some Zoom basics. If you need to access the chat, just tap on your phone and you should get a little menu like this little black bar, um, hit participants and a little chat uh, line should come in. Go ahead and type your message and hit the little thing that looks like a paper plane and that will send your message. And any new chats will be indicated in this little uh, bubble there at the bottom. Uh, there'll be little numbers there. And why do we want you to chat? because this, like I said, is a series. We are in class four oils for every age. And if you watch or attend all eight classes and complete the Google forms as uh, per the instructions, you will earn a diffuser. Now it's not a chance to win a diffuser. It's actually, you're going to earn a diffuser. So uh, make sure you, you watch, make sure you get those Google forms in. Here is some contact information for Amanda. There's her email and her YouTube channel and her direct doTERRA phone number. If you want to reach out to her, that would be where to reach her. But we also have this great community on Facebook. We have our essential oil place, which is um, a great page that you can get lots of information. You have to have a doTERRA account, but if you do and you go ahead and join that group, um, if you haven't or you don't know how to find it, let us know and we'll invite you. Uh, once you are in, you can ask questions. You could search and see if other people have already asked questions and people will reach out and give you answers pretty quickly. So it's a lot of fun. And they also have a monthly training that you can attend, which is really great. Uh, then there's our group. Uh, or Amanda's group are enamored with nature oil education group. There's no doTERRA account required for that one. It's a great group. If you, if you have friends that you find are interested in oils and you just kind of want to ease them in, go ahead and invite them to this group. We'd love to have more people there. And it's just a little more on the fun side. We just try to give out more information and maybe there's a slight more of an emphasis on empowering kiddos and moms with kiddos to be able to make, uh, to reach for natural solutions first. So those are two great ways to feel some community in this group of ours. Um, and when you enrolled, you should have gotten an email with a PDF that looks something like this. There is a bunch of great information on this PDF. So if you did not get that, reach out to us and we'll make sure you get we get that out to you. All right. So today's class is on um, oils for every age. So I wanted to start out just asking, what stage do you need most support for in your life right now? And you could throw that in the chat. Um, so we're going to be talking about infants to age two, pregnancy, school-aged kids, adolescents, uh, regular adults, and then elderly. So if you want to think about those six, what stages do you need the most support for right now? And like I said, um, I think there's going to be information here for everybody. But as I go through, when I cover maybe a stage of life that you're not in, for example, if nobody here has infants or is pregnant, don't zone out necessarily. Stay in tune because maybe you can think of somebody in your life that is in that stage and that you might want to pass on this information to them. We would love to pass it on to them and have them uh, know what's going on or what, what, you know, benefit from this great information. Uh, also, I would love to recommend to you guys before we get started um, that you consider getting a reference book 
for um, just like your journey with oils in general. And the reason I say this is because um, some of these have great information that is going to be at your fingertips. And honestly, a lot of times, Amanda and I, uh, if you ask us questions, I, you know, it may sound like we know everything we don't. 90% um, of the time we open up a book and we look at that ailment that you guys have asked us about and we tell you what's in the book. Sometimes we do know some stuff because people have asked us and so we have experience. So we've just walked a couple more months than you have. That's all that's going on. And we've used our books a little bit more often. So the book I recommend the most is Modern Essentials. It's kind of more of an encyclopedia type book, um, but it's just a set up really nicely. You've got your oils, your blends, ailments, and then um, just kind of a DIY section. Um, the Essential Life book would be my second recommendation. Um, this one is very pretty. It's just got beautiful pictures and it's still set up with fabulous information. The information here is no less better than what's in the Modern Essentials book. It's just set up differently. So if you want pretty pictures, go with the Essential Life book. But any of these are great. These two on the bottom are a little bit more focused. Symphony of the Cells we're going to talk about at the end of this class. And the Essential Emotions book, um, that's just a book for a whole other lesson where we'll go into depth about it or something. <laughs> but uh, I, I love love this book. Um, yeah, I won't go into that because I'll take 20 minutes. <laughs> All right. So we are um, going to start, but before I get started, did anybody have a particular life part of life that they want to focus on? Amanda, did you see anybody answer? <laughs> well, I'm kind of embarrassed to say I, I accidentally, I was answering and then I, I accidentally like um, shut myself off and I had to come back. And so everything has disappeared. So probably oh, no. people, but let's just go ahead and move forward. <laughs> okay. We will move forward. All right. So oils for every age. And like I said, there's something in here for everybody. And if there's not something for you, there's probably something in here for somebody, you know, so we're going to start with infants. Um, before I jump into that though, I do wanna emphasize since we are talking about oils for every age, just um, here at the top of our um, PDF for today, it says doTERRA essential oils are the most tested and the most trusted essential oils. And that is part of the reason why um, I can recommend with confidence all of these oils and all of the ways that we talk about applying them and using them um, safely from little ones all the way to the elderly. It's because doTERRA goes to great lengths to make sure that they have the safest products on the market and that they are giving us the, basically the wisest choices so we can make awesome natural health care um, choices. So um, I wouldn't do some of the things we'll recommend today with some oils that are out there because I don't know how pure they are. So I would stick with doTERRA because of their purity standard and their promise. And so especially for kiddos. Um, so for little guys, um, we want to talk about dilution before we get too much into this, especially for little guys. Our oils are so potent that you want to make sure that you're diluting them in a way that's going to be safe for little guys. So I'm going to bring up a little picture here. Um, this is just a little chart. If you guys want to take a screenshot of this, if you need, um, if you want the PDF, let us know and we'll get you a link for that. But um, so diluting. Uh, these are the recommendations. So if you've got little kiddos who are under two years old and you're working with a 10 ml roller bottle. So some of you guys probably got little samples. Uh, we probably gave you a little five ml bottle. This is the bigger 10 ml bottle. Um, for a little guy, you'd probably want one tenth of that to be oils and the rest to be fractionated coconut oil. For two to six, you want to go at most a fourth. And then for six years and older, about a third. Um, also, just a, a quick note with the elderly, you want to stick with the bigger dilution. Like you want, you want them to be more diluted. And then we'll get into that when we get to that stage of life. But there's just something to be aware of to keep them in the, the this side of things, not necessarily in the adult side of things. Um, the other thing I want to make sure you guys think when you're making blends is less is going to be more. Our oils are so potent that you don't have to like jam pack it in there with all the oils, you know, um, and then just a little bit of fractionated coconut oil. You can always add more oils. So um, err on the side of less. And then if you feel like you're not getting the results you want, you could always add more. But once it's all in there, it's a lot harder to take it away. <laughs> so. Um, 
that's just a little bit on dilution. Um, alrighty. So doTERRA does also provide these great on guard, uh, these great touch rollers that have already been diluted. doTERRA has already done the work to find just the perfect combination, the perfect ratio of oils to, um, to fractionated coconut oil so that there's minimal flash. You know, when you open up your bottles and you smell the oils, that wonderful aroma that comes out, um, they've calculated the right balance so that the least amount of flash comes off, but there's, it's the most potent it could be. And so they've already done the work. So whenever you see a, a roller that says touch on it, it means that it's already diluted and it's ready to use as is. You don't have to worry about it. And On Guard is a great one that you can use with little guys to help boost the immune, the immune system. And Tamer is one that you can use to help with tummy issues. Tamer is actually a kid's blend, so it's milder. doTERRA has already formulated it for children. But if at any time, like with any of these, you feel like, well, my kiddo is just so itty bitty, or um, I'm just not sure I'm comfortable with this, you know, an adult strength roller on my little one, you can just go ahead and roll that on your hand, like some on guard on your hand, and then add a little bit of fractionated coconut oil on top of that, and then swipe that onto the bottom of the baby's feet or even down their spine. And in that way you get an even greater dilution and it'll, it'll just be even more gentle on the baby. But those are great ways to get these oils into the baby system and to help the boost their immune system or help their tummy. Or if you use a different oil or a different touch roller to help them with whatever issue you're trying to help with. Also, we have this unscented lotion. So how often did you guys lather up these little babies in lotion when they were born? I mean, they're, they're, you know, cocooned in this wet, moist environment and they come out into this, this harsh world. And, um, and we try to put lotion all over them to keep them, uh, keep their skin nice and smooth. And we don't always think about what is in those lotions. So we want lotions that are paraben free, that are free of fragrance and all this we talked about in the last week's class. So I'm not going to get all into, you know, fragrance and all that stuff, but doTERRA makes an unscented lotion that you can go ahead and add oils to, to make it whatever it is you need at the moment. So if you are putting lotion on at bedtime and you need your little kiddo to relax and go to sleep, you can throw some lavender in there and help them to have a, a restful evening. If they have maybe a little issue with their skin, like, um, and a little rash or something, you can add a little bit of melaleuca to give it a little bit of healing power. You know, so you can really customize that lotion to be whatever you want. And it doesn't have the dangerous things that we don't want in there on our baby's skin. Remember the organ is the biggest, the skin is your biggest organ. And now you're applying this stuff on it. So you want to put good stuff on there. Um, doTERRA also has a couple of other products that are really awesome for kids. Um, they have a baby wash and a, a baby lotion, as well as a diaper cream for diaper rash, which if everyone's paying attention, <laughs> this is your code word for today, diaper rash. So make sure you save that word because you're going to need that for your Google form later. <laughs> and just to note, um, one of the noticeable differences between the doTERRA baby collection and other brands is the chemicals that have not been used. So they've left out all that bad stuff. There's the parabens that shouldn't be in there. And I can't pronounce that word. And the polypropyl glycol and all these other complicated things that have no business being in a baby's lotion. So they've left those out. And this is a great little collection um, that's safe for the little guys. And the last thing I wanted to talk about is diffusers. Diffusers are also a great way to get oils into little babies. And so they just breathe it in. You don't even have to get it on their skin. And again, the Terra, because they're pure and safe, you know that these oils are safe for their little lungs. Um, you can use lavender to help the child have a restful sleep. If they have a little respiratory um, distress going on, you could use breathe to help support their respiratory system. And with diffusers, because the little guys are so small, Really, you just need to run it about half an hour when they're going to bed and that's it. It should stay in the air. It should be in their lungs and that should be plenty to get them um, the support they need for the evening. So you don't need to overdo it with the diffuser and always less is more. You can always put less. If you feel like it's not working, you can add a little bit more oil, but you don't want to overdo it from the beginning. 
Any questions about any of that so far for babies before we move on? Anything you want to add to that, Amanda? Oh, I just verify. I love your, your idea about the checking into that unscented lotion that doTERRA carries because um, I most of the people that I know that are kind of lotion snobs tend to uh, tend to love, love, love this particular lotion. And if you don't know why you shouldn't have the propylene glycol and the, um, the parabens and the mineral oil and stuff like that in there, then you can go back to um, uh, week three of the eight in the series. And I'll give you a little bit extra info about why we need to keep things clean, especially for the thin, thin skin of the infants and also for the elderly. That's all. Love it. Thank you. All right. So then we're moving on to um, pregnancy. So during pregnancy, uh, a great oil to help support your um, your um, pregnancy would be to do um, terazyme. Terazyme is something you could take with every meal. It's just those enzymes that will help you break down food and get more of the nutrients out of the food. So, and you're, you know, making a child. So you might as well be getting those nutrients and getting all you can. Uh, what is neat is once you are nursing, Terazyme passes through the breast milk and it will help your baby have a settled stomach. So that's how many people want that for their little one, especially if you eat something you might not have needed to eat. <laughs> and so the Terazyme will pass through and will help settle your baby's stomach as well. Copaiba is a great one that you can put under your tongue two, two times a day and it will help give you a little boost in your milk supply. But copaiba is also just great for calming and for uh, inflammation and, you know, particularly calming. What mom doesn't need a little bit of calm in her life, especially when she's got a little baby. <laughs> so that's an awesome one to do. Uh, a couple of other oils, basil and fennel have been um, shown to support healthy milk supply. So those are great that you can just apply around your, your breast tissue. Um, I would just say avoid the area where your child is gonna latch on. They might not like the taste necessarily of the oil. So if you kind of go around um, the breast mm -hmm. tissue and then maybe wipe My it kids off. actually liked it. My, or at least the one that I nursed with uh, liked it because it ends up tasting a little bit like licorice, the fennel specifically. <laughs> and now you have to also go in here. I know maybe that's TMI. <laughs> Hopefully no one has been figured out by that. Um, and the Copa Yuba, I have to tell you guys too, uh, it really helps like, you know, the, the anxious feelings that moms uh, to be typically get really, really helpful for that, as well as the aches and pains that moms to be typically get. Um, it was much, much reduced for my doTERRA pregnancy compared to my previous pregnancies. And usually um, when you're going on, you know, birth number three, it gets worse, you know, at, like each one gets excessively a little bit more painful. You have a little bit less energy, like stuff like that. And uh, it really wasn't the case for me um, because I had doTERRA. So Copaiba is fantastic. So I just wanted to throw that in there. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate Amanda because she's closer to this than I am. And my kids were like this big by the time I... <laughs> I got into oils, so I don't have a lot of baby experience, but Amanda's the, the voice of wisdom in the background. <laughs> so, um, so basil and fennel. So yeah, just um, see how it works and use it. If you feel like the little one is not liking the taste, you can just wipe that away before you nurse and then add some again after. Um, and then just a word of caution, uh, peppermint, just be careful with peppermint. It is, um, some people have noted that, oh, I'm sorry. Some people have noted that um, peppermint could interfere with the milk supply, decrease it just a little bit. So um, just be aware of that. If you find that you use a blend that has peppermint or you use peppermint for a headache or pain and it affects your milk supply, just be aware of that. If you need it, if you need to use peppermint for pain, you could always substitute it with Siberian fur or um, I had another one here. Hold on. Or I love Siberian for for it. Yeah. Yeah. And I, my experience just with other moms and stuff is it's usually like an 80, 20, probably 20% of people feel like there's a, a difference. And then 80% of people won't really notice any difference unless they're taking it internally every single day. Like if you're having it in your coffee every day or something mm -hmm. like that, mm -hmm. you'll notice, but yeah. But yeah. So easy, yeah. easy sub out with the Siberian fur and um, some other Winter things. Wintergreen even for pain. Wintergreen is great for pain. 
Um, yeah, and the Copaiba, I would say okay, so it's great for Copaiba are just pretty fantastic. Yeah. So. Or if you're using it for nausea and you're and you're having and you have some concerns, you could try spearmint instead. That's a great one for for that yes. as well. So there are there are um, swaps that you can do. And if you're kind of at a loss, reach out to, to us and we will try to point you in the right direction for that. Yeah. In fact, um, if you guys want some extra stuff specifically about pregnancy or you have a close, close friend who you know really wants some of these answers, um, uh, you can just let us know in your Google form and I will be happy to email you a more complete list of that as well. Yeah. And aren't we having, weren't there talks about a class on pregnancy and oil, yes, isn't there? I, yes, we've been talking about it for a while. Uh, it, it's possible it may still go down here in May. Um, we have a sampling initiative for anxiety and, or anxious feelings and for sleep issues. And so I was concerned that there may be overload for people having too many options of things to, to kind of, you know, get info for. So, uh, there may or may not, I, I don't know. You know yeah, what, how about this? I'm going to see what kind of response we get. Yeah. So <laughs> and if, if, there's, you, if there's a couple of if you, if you're watching this and you want a baby class, you need to say something on the Google form or reach out to Amanda, reach out to me and let us know, hey, I want a baby class. I want to know everything there is to know. And we will make that happen. So so stay tuned. And I want to know from you guys, has anyone in the chat tried Copaiba? And if so, how and what did you think about it? And I'll, we'll get back to that. I'm going to move on to school age children. So with school age children, we have some great products. Um, there are the first ones here, the uh, vitamins, PB Assist and the Kids Kit. The PB Assist is really great. It's like a pixie stick. And so it's like a fun little candy almost that you just rip the little thing and you open and you, you know, put it in your mouth and it tastes great. In fact, it is one of those products. There's a lot of products on here today that I'm going to talk about, but it is one of those products that's good for every age. In fact, uh, one woman I was listening to said she interchanges her PB assist with the adult PB assist, the adult PB assist with the adult PB assist junior. Did I say that right? She mixes them. <laughs> so one day she'll have the junior, one day she'll have the adult and then she'll switch um, because she likes it that much because there's different strains too of the, the good bacteria that's in there. So why not give your body a little bit of novelty every now and then? So she really enjoys both of those, but that's a great way to start getting these um, great um, bacteria to support children's gut very early. Um, the vitamin kit is really great too for kiddos who aren't quite swallowing um, pills yet. The, they have the vitamin chewables, which are really fun to just chew on, but they also have omegas, which are great for your brain. Who doesn't want great stuff for your brain when you're um, that young and, and, you know, forming and learning and doing so much. So it's great uh, for them. Also, just a little secret, one of Amanda's secrets for making gel caps, I'm going to give it away here, is that she uses this omega oil to fill up her gel caps instead of just putting fractionated coconut oil in there like I do. So it gives a little added boost to that little um, gel cap that you got a little bit of ac extra um, omegas in there. So just a little fun tip. The, um, I'll, I'll try to link up the, the little video to that. Maybe I'll try to... Um connected at the end so that people can can watch the little because I think it's only like like a five minute video yeah like that. it's short yep yeah. yep yeah okay I'll do it at the end too <laughs> um then also for kiddos who have not yet learned to swallow anything or maybe that you know the on guard is a little too strong for them when they're this age we have these on guard beadlets they are a great option for internal support um, for that immune system support. Uh, they're little tiny itty bitty, they're just minuscule little beadlets that they can either pop open in their mouth. And if they don't like the taste, they can just go ahead and swallow them and not even have to taste it. And so it's a great way, just uh, give them one in the morning when they're leaving the car to go into the school and then give them one um, when you pick them up and, and they come back into the car and that way you're boosting their immune system throughout the day. And um, if there's only a quarter drop of um, on guard essential oil in there, so super safe for little guys, you know, you're far from overdoing it with that one. And then the next kit is another one of those really super duper fun kits 
that are good actually for everybody. I know it says the kids collection, but I know people who um, have flat out said, I have my kids collection and I have their kids collection. <laughs> And so this is one that everybody can use. It is a kit of seven rollers. They include um, Thinker, which is to help focus. That's actually one of my favorites. I, I interchange Thinker with the adult version, but I kind of like Thinker better. Um, there's Calmer, which helps for sleep. There's Stronger, which is um, like your immune boosting roller for kids. There's Tamer, which is a stomach um, blend to help um, upset stomach. Um, there is rescuer, which is, um, oh, I almost had that's a the one that's like deep blue, deep blue for pain. So mm -hmm. pain, and then there's steady. That's kind of like your balance. So kind of calming and steadying. And then there's brave, which is just, um, its own wonderful blend for when you need courage and bravery. Um, uh, that's not like nothing else. Um, so, uh, these are all formulated for the strength for younger kids and younger, smaller bodies. But like I said, adults love them. So with that, I wanted to ask my next question, which is based on my little description, which of the kids collection roller bottle would you keep for yourself instead of passing on to your children? And while you guys are answering, I'm going to let you know that I, um, oh, actually my, if you want to stop sharing your screen, I'm going to hold sure. something up real quick. If we can. Um, I, I have been walking around all day with the stronger in my pocket because, um, this happens to be one of my kids favorite because of course it makes him stronger and it's red. <laughs> um, but something that I think is fantastic about it is, um, it's so, so gentle that my, my particular, uh, kiddo has some food sensitivities and some digestion issues that are related to the food sensitivities. And uh, so his skin also is much more prone to finding rashes and, you know, and if, if he gets a scrape, it's more prone to, to bleed more, or, you know, like it just seems like his, his little system is a little different. So he wants to feel stronger and this has nothing that is like harsh in it. So all the things that would be in our guard, that would be like the clove and the cinnamon that we would consider like hot oils that we really want to dilute for him anyway. This doesn't actually have that, but it's still an amazing immune booster. It's got the rose, the frankincense, the cedar wood, and let's see, I think is the other one in there. So it's really, really fantastic. So even if he like actually had this in my pocket today, I happen to be in North Carolina at a cabin. We go out for our walk every day, which mostly includes going up and down different mountains and hills and things like that. And so when you get an inevitable scrape, this is really fast to go on. Like I do usually carry some little boo-boo spray, but I haven't been uh, because this has been supplying some really good stuff. Um, it's, uh, yeah, the rose is, like I said, immune boosting as well as very soothing for skin, things like that. Um, also good for poison ivy, poison oak, things like that. Um, so that is one of my favorites. And then, man, oh man, like the brave is so, like, so out of this world. If you guys haven't tried it, um, yeah, like some people use it as their own perfume, especially if they're kind of like moving through something on the emotional side of things. It's so, so great. Oh, the tamer actually, especially as like a very gentle alternative to the digestion, uh, like the spearmint in it, as opposed to peppermint. And I don't, I don't even know what else makes it so gentle, but it's just whole different, still super effective digestive kind of amazingness. And it's just, just so, so fun. So anyway, I'm probably taking up too much time. Oh, you know what? I was going to actually um, read off to you guys. Okay. So the person who, some of the people who answered about Copa Iba said that they had um, uh, ordered it. Can't wait to try it. A couple people said, yes, they tried it. Under the tongue seems to be um, the, the way to go. Uh, another person says that they use the Copa Iba all over, which means topical stuff is so, so great. I totally agree with that. Mm -hmm. um, I have it in a lot of my mixes as well. All right. Back to you, Marcella. Awesome. Let me start sharing here again. Hold on. All right. So we are so and then people are answering about which little um, now Amanda gave you more ideas, which roller you want to keep for yourself. So make sure you, you let us know. 
and we're going to move on to adolescence. So this is that time changes, big changes are happening in kids. And so uh, we want to support hormonal changes, which often affect skin. So the HD clear skin care um, system is a great system for just balancing those changes in skin. Um, it's just a great line formulated for that. So that's something that kids can start getting on as well as um, this is a great time once they have transitioned and don't need to be chewing on um, pills anymore, but can start swallowing it is a great time to get them started on half a dose of the LLV, which is foundational. Basically, if you can get kids started at a young age, having this, this new, new, these nutrients and supplements in their life is just going to be so great foundational for them. Um, so half a dose, cause they're so much smaller than us and growing. Um, they don't need a whole lot. I'm going to get more into LLV a little bit later. So I'm not going to talk too much about it right now because LLV is one of those products that's basically good for everyone of all ages. Once adolescence kind of gets going and they've moved out of the kids uh, version. So um, it's just great stuff. Then a diffuser. Uh, this is a good time uh, in a kid's life to go ahead and uh, you've already been empowering them with the kids collection so that they know. Did I mention that the kids collection has little pictures on it? I don't think I mentioned that. It has little pictures on the bottles that will kind of clue the kid into what this, this particular bottle will do. So like Thinker has a little brain on it. So they know that this is for focus. So you're starting to teach your kids to reach for natural solutions first and, and to kind of know what to do. And so once they move into adolescence, why not help them make their own blends that they can put in their diffuser, maybe have one for focus, have one for winding down at the end of night, have one for the morning for waking up and getting their pep in their step and let them take ownership for turning on their diffuser and getting it going. And the best way to do that is to get them the coolest diffuser you can find. So <laughs> go on to the doTERRA website, find one that they love. This is one example of one, and they can um, put oils in there that will adapt to whatever situation they need. I'm going to um, add another sneaky little thing, mom of, you know, teenagers here. Um, diffusers are also really easy ways to give your kid a dose of emotional or mood support without them really kind of having to choose into it. Like there's a lot of ownership that happens when they get to make their own. And that is fantastic. That's what we want. But sometimes they don't realize that they're being super cranky, which we'll probably talk, talk a little bit more about for Clary Calm. But um, uh, so it's another way for just for, for us moms to be able to support our adolescents in, in whatever way possible, but a little on the sneaky side, because we can put in it things that are going to help, even if they don't realize that they're being a little bit more angry than they usually are, or like woke up on the wrong side of bed kind of thing. It's, it's a fun little sneaky trick. Yes. Yeah. And I think most of you have probably heard my lemongrass story. So people don't always have to know what the oils are for or why we're diffusing them. They just need to know that they smell good. <laughs> so if you haven't heard my lemongrass story, I'm not going to get into it today. You can ask me later. <laughs> Then Clericom, as Amanda said, Clericom is another um, one of those oils that's great for adolescents. It's actually one of those two that's great for all ages once um, kids kind of, you know, start hitting those hormonal changes and things like that. Uh, it is um, meant to help with hormone support. So think women, female problems that time in the month, but it is not only for that time in the month. It is just overall just hormone balance. So it's really, um, it's just a great supportive oil, good for all ages. So, you know, when you're starting your menstrual cycle all the way to when you're ending your menstrual cycle later on in life and you need that support to transition. So um, uh, just a great, a great oil to have around. I did want to take a minute too and just show you guys one thing that's not on this handout that is also available and around this time is when kids might start needing it is the doTERRA deodorants. Um, I did mention them last time, so I won't get into all the details, but um, they don't have aluminum. They don't have any of the bad stuff that you don't want in there. And they do have two choices right now. They have the balance, which has baking soda and the more sensitive one, which is a Douglas fir and Greek orange that is baking soda free. So those are just some more options for helping adolescents through that time. Um, let's see, was there any other? No. Did anybody answer what they wanted with the kids roller, which one they're keeping for themselves? 
or is we had someone quiet? answer brave I think they listened in on our <laughs> thing too so <laughs> brave yeah I, I I believe I smelled brave but I don't know that I, I don't own it I don't remember trying it but I think I, mm -hmm. it's either brave or stronger and, and I definitely really like I definitely prefer the thinker over in tune because the in tune seems to have kind of a lot more patchouli smell which I'm not super into so the thinker is also another one that I have my own uh, that I keep in my office versus the one that my kids get to use that's in yeah. their little set thing up. Yep. Yep. Yeah, I do. Thinker is actually in my, um, I have it right in front of me. It's in my little case that I carry all over with me and Thinker is in there. It is one that I love. All right. So moving on to adults. Um, so here's where I wanted to spend a little more time talking about, um, I'm sorry, talking about LLV. And I have to just do a shout out for LLV. It is, um, it is foundational. I, I can't tell you enough how I feel like when I forget my LLV, I, I'm just more sluggish. I just, the oils don't seem to be, I have to work, put twice as much on. They have to work harder. Um, I, everything just starts breaking through all my symptoms of different things. But when I remember to be consistent about my LLV, I just feel better, which is the reason, a couple of the reasons why um, LLV is the number one selling product that doTERRA sells. They, they um, even though we're an oil company, they give you a 30 day guarantee. And um, if you take it for 30 days and you don't feel increased energy, increased mental clarity, you know, decreased inflammation, maybe even better mood emotionally, they will give you your money back. You can just send back the empty bottles and they will give you your money back. So there's, there's a money back guarantee that nothing to lose to just try it. And I do have to let you guys know that the best way to get LLV by far is to do it through LRP. If you were to purchase the bottles individually, they cost a wholesale almost 160. But if you get them bundled in, in your loyalty rewards order, they cost just about $80. So that's almost half off. Well, that is half off pretty much. And then you get to add on three supplements at a significant savings. So you can add three of these on for savings. And the one that always blows my mind is the deep blue polyphenol complex, which is amazing for inflammation and pain and things like that. It normally costs 60 and it, you can get it for $20. So that's how I always get my deep blue polyphenol complex. So, um, if you're going to give these a try, I suggest that you go ahead and set up a loyalty rewards order and get the biggest savings possible that way. Um, it is, again, it's just foundational and it fills those nutritional gaps. You have your vitamins that are going to give you all the vitamins that you need. You have your omegas that are supporting your brain and um, you have your alpha CRX, which supports your cells. So not only are you going to feel better and live longer, but it's going to just help you from the inside out. <laughs> um, Terrazyme, again, we talked a little bit before about Terrazyme. It is um, the, the one thing that you need to help support your digestive system. So um, the way the enzymes work is our body kind of has two enzymes. It has main enzymes. It has meta metabolic and digestive. Um, your body can make both, but you can, you can get digestive enzymes from outside sources. You cannot get metabolic enzymes from outside sources. So if you're low on, on enzymes, as you get older, we get a little bit lower on them. Your body is going to focus on the di making more digestive enzymes and kind of slack off on the metabolic enzymes because it feels like maybe that's more important. And so if we can support our body by giving it digestive enzymes, our body can focus on making the metabolic enzymes that we can't get anywhere else. And then we'll be more in balance and be able to break down all the nutrients better and get the most out of our, the food we're eating. So it's why enzymes are super important just to have them in our diet. And you can be taking two to three a days, two or three of these with each meal, depending on kind of what you're eating, you know, the more protein, maybe uh, if you have a little bit of issue with cheese, you know, if you have a little bit more, if you have cheese, or I know Amanda has shared that she has been a lifesaver for her with her little one that has gluten issues as well as other allergy issues where she'll, um, put that in, in his, um, um, like honey or something to get him to be able to swallow that if she feels he's been exposed to something that's upsetting his system. So, 
Um, that's a great one to have. And then lemon, just in general, lemon oil um, is great for detox. Uh, in fact, tangerine is also great for detox. Any of the citruses are awesome for detoxing from the inside out. In fact, these three things right here, your lifelong vitality, your terrazyme, and your lemon are Dr. Hill. He's uh, one of the founding uh, members of doTERRA and he's a doctor and he does recommendations. His recommendation is everybody should be doing LLV. Everybody should be doing terrazyme. Everybody should be using lemon. They should put a drop of balance on the bottom of their feet and they should be taking frankincense internally. So this is like three of the five things that he usually recommends for a daily routine. Now, by the way, we do have a, an organized cleanse coming up beginning yes. on May 26th and that may be impaired. I, I know, I know several people who are actually on here, Rose being one of them and myself, um, Marcella, you also started, um, have been through this cleanse once before, or in my case, this was like my fourth time. Um, and, uh, those lifelong vitality, the terrorism, the probiotic lemon, those kinds of things, uh, plus a couple extra things that are, are provide much more um, even like organ cleansing methods that'll begin on the 26th. So reach out or put it in the comments um, of the Google form if you want some more information about that because um, you'll want to be able to order that at loyalty rewards style so that you get points for it and get the deepest discount, which Marcella had just mentioned about the lifelong vitality supplements. You only want to be ordering through lifelong or for uh, through loyalty rewards. Um, to be able to get the, the best discount. We want you guys to be savvy shoppers so that not only do you feel confident about what it is that you're ordering and how to use what it is that you're ordering, but also to get the very best price for it as well. Yeah, great. Um, and so we have our oils that support us just in general. We know already, if you've listened to us ever, we've told you <laughs> there's three ways you can use your oils, uh, aromatic, topically, and internally. Um, Citrus Bliss is a great one for just uplifting your mood. And it's just a great one to replace any plugins that you might have that put fragrance into your air, maybe to replace some candles, some room sprays, anything like that, that has stuff that we don't really want to be breathing in anymore. Um, so Citrus Bliss is a great one to use aromatically. Um, topically, I mean, we're just touching on a couple of things to help support you. And topically, there's so many different oils that we could use, but um, Motivate, is a great touch roller that um, you can use. I, I, I don't know how many people have said it, but it, anytime we use Motivate, it feels like we get six times more things done <laughs> than we normally would. It helps me stay focused, to stay on track so that I can get stuff done. So it's a great one. And then adaptive. Adaptive is just like what it says. It helps you adapt to any situation. So if you're feeling stressed, um, if, if you just have a lot going on and you need to figure out how to get through it, adaptive is great for that. So those two are great options to use daily. And then internally, like I said, with the lemon, um, any of the citrus oils are great for detoxifying and for helping your digestion. They, um, you can put them in your water, make sure you shake up your bottle because oils and water always uh, will separate. So just shake them before you drink and make sure that you use glass or stainless steel because the citrus oils will break down plastic and then you'll be drinking the stuff that they're breaking down. So you want to use it in a nice safe container and you want to use up to 24 drops. That would be the maximum. You want to stay under that. I tend to do about three drops in 24 ounces and that is plenty with our oils. And I might fill that up throughout the day and maybe add one or two drops throughout the day. But I find that really, um, you just don't need a whole lot because our oils are so pure. Um, let me see, was there anything else? Okay, move, any questions so far? Yeah, awesome. We're gonna try to wrap this up quickly because I know I'm running out of time here. <laughs> So glory days, um, back to um, diluting. Remember what I said with the elderly, their skin does tend to thin a little. So you want to dilute more at the rate that you would dilute for little guys. Um, do less, less is going to be more with them. And fractionated coconut oil is a great way to dilute the oils and it helps the skin as well. It's just wonderful. Lifelong vitality, again, um, it is 
one that we can use for all ages. It supports your joints. It's going to help improve energy and it nourishes the brain, which who doesn't want that at, at the older years in life. Um, and then bone nutrient bone nutrient is another one. This one in particular is really good for all ages <laughs> from little, little tiny ones all the way to elderly. Uh, it's in the elderly here in the, in the glory years, but it's it really, um, it has a combination of both calcium and magnesium, which those are kind of linked. You can't really fix one. If you have deficiency without fixing the other, they need to kind of stay together. So it has a hundred percent of both. It has vitamin D two and three. It helps with bone mass and most bone density. It's great, not only for um, older people, but even for adolescents, for little guys who are building bones, you would just give them way less than what you would give an adult. In fact, I know somebody whose little one uh, was born with a hip issue and she's giving him just, she opens up the tablet and gives him just a fraction of what's in there to help support his bones. And she's been doing that since he is little, little, little. So um, that's a great one as well. I to have, that's one that I I take regularly and I, and I make sure I don't forget so I can support my, my bones. Um, so finally, I just want to do a quick, um, oh no, before I do that, um, for those of us who are older and maybe struggle with a little bit of brain fog, this is a, a screenshot opportunity here. <laughs> um, there's a, a roller bottle blend for when you're feeling that kind of brain fog that includes wild orange, bergamot, rosemary, peppermint, and frankincense. And there is a diffuser blend that's rosemary, peppermint, and wild orange, which I really love that diffuser blend to just kind of help me kind of focus. Um, so those are great for brain fog for the older, older years <laughs> when we're, we can't quite focus as well. Um, go away. All right. So the last thing I'm just going to touch really quickly on is Symphony of the Cells. I mentioned that book as one of the references um, Symphony of the Cells is an application method where you take different oils and you kind of layer them over the spine. They, the different oils address different body systems. And as you layer them on, it drives the oils deeper into your body so that they can start affecting those, those body systems in positive ways. And these are just two protocols that you can use. Um, if you want more information on Symphony of the Cells, I believe the next class is actually Symphony of the Cells, isn't it? So we will talk more about that then. I won't get into all of that right now since we're kind of running late on time. The last thing I needed to tell you about was um, the cleanse, which Amanda already mentioned. And I'm not going to get into LRP right now because we're tight on time, but I did just want to throw out there really quickly that this month, if you have set up an LRP order and you order 125 PV or more before or on May 15th, you can get Clementine for free. And our product, um, our special of the month is geranium, which is 15% off. So I just wanted you guys to know that that was there. Uh, anything else, Amanda, before we jump into the next little part of our talk? Those are beautiful. I, I can't think of anything else. I think you've covered all of the awesome things. I am also really, really excited about uh, week five, Symphony of the Cells, because that's um, that's usually something that begins to start blowing people's minds. It's just so effective and it's been so easy, um, but it's very supportive for those long-term problems. So y'all make sure you Tune in for that one. <laughs> yes, Bye. definitely. All right. And so Amanda's going to talk to us about pipe building a pipeline. And yeah. I'm going to try to switch over while you maybe start. <laughs> <laughs> sure, sure. So um, the deal is there's usually three types of people who are loving, loving, loving doTERRA. And 85% of all the people who love doTERRA are just interested in living a natural lifestyle they just, they, they like finding those solutions that they wanted for themselves, for their family, for, um, you know, just someone super close to them. And um, just being able to have that uh, is totally enough. And doTERRA supports this kind of person mm -hmm. by providing a bunch of different methods of education. And you guys have already seen some of the Facebook groups that, um, that we run ourselves, but there's a lot of things on the doTERRA website as far as eBooks and things like that. 
there's uh, there's podcasts, there's uh, YouTube videos, there's just so many different ways. And and we, especially like in our group right here, we'd like to really support you guys to help you know where to get that education so that you feel super empowered using the things that you've got from doTERRA. Now, um, I didn't know that I was going to end up being a person number two, which is a sharer. <laughs> and, uh, but I just, I just like wasn't able to keep my mouth shut about it. I'm, I'm always now finding people who, who are mentioning, I just, I just happen to like, they, I draw them to me. They, you know, come and lament that they've taken their eight ibuprofen, um, that day and they still have like this headache that they can't kick or, or they're having like these really bad cramps or whatever. And I know that I have a solution and I can't keep myself from sharing with them. And so, um, I end up giving them a sample and they love it. And um, that has enabled me over the years to be able to never pay a cent out of my personal budget, like the one that my husband and I have to agree on. <laughs> I never paid uh, out of my, uh, not one dime, as my husband says, um, uh, for my own um, doTERRA products, including the lifelong vitality supplements. And I'll tell you, sometimes like a family my size, we get up into the 300s sometimes of, of things. And I'm very, very, was have been easily able to uh, to pay for those products. And that's what, uh, what we call the, uh, what do we call that? Natural healthcare with doTERRA. So free natural healthcare mm -hmm. with doTERRA. And, um, and so I love, love, love that uh, for a little bit. And then I had an interesting experience that caused me to, to recognize that I needed to actually be person number three and uh, be able to earn an income and make an impact. And what happened was um, I had uh, an experience where I had already been using um, doTERRA for a, a while and loving it and having some of my things pay for, uh, but I was still like new to a lot of things. And my two, my two, two-ish year old, two, two years, four months um, old son was jumping a lot on near the bunk beds and his, his laughter, you know, left his tongue out and he crammed down on one of the bars. And I really, really honestly thought that I was going to have to detach um, the remaining portion of his tongue because he just, he bit it so hard and there was so much blood. And just as, as a mom, although it was, I was, I was, you know, like child number four, but you know, when it's a bad thing, <laughs> you know, you know, when it's time to take somebody to the hospital. So I was, I was having my 12 year old change the, my four month old baby's diaper. And I was trying to get my four year old to, to get her shoes. And I was talking on the phone and trying to like connect with the pediatrician father-in-law and all the things. And in my desperation, I reached out for this bottle of Helly Crisp that at that time I had not opened because it costs a lot. It's like $69 for a five ML. And I was like, well, I'm going to buy it because everybody says I need it, but I don't think I'll ever actually use it. But it turned out I, in desperation, I was like, maybe it really will stop the blood flow. Everybody says it does. And so I, I gave it a try, put it like right directly on his tongue within two minutes. Like he's like pretty calm and I'm like, hmm, what's going on here? I, and about 10 minutes later, I had put on a second one and I just started to feel like, you know what, this is, this is going to be okay. Like I, maybe this isn't quite as, as like, maybe I don't have to drag my kids to the emergency room. Maybe I don't have to, I just started to feel like something that was um, that I had the tools in my own home that I could use and uh, and be a healer and and, uh, and just it was just so empowering and I started to have this vision come to me that I was like what if I didn't have to be uh, what if I didn't let other moms like me be in this kind of situation again where um, where I didn't have the solutions and so I wanted to develop um, a, a group of a community of other women, of other moms who had solutions like this, who could not only um, not only use them strong and be courageous in the way that they were going to experiment with them, but also um, teach others to teach others to teach others. And uh, that just the idea of making the impact and changing the world, you know, like one mom at a time thrilled me so much that that's, that's what happened is I decided I needed to um, I wanted to have that freedom lifestyle and, uh, and wanted to be able to be, um, yeah, to, to not only supplement my income, uh, or just pay for my oil habit, but more than that, I needed 
to be able to uh, to yeah to live a freedom lifestyle. So the difference in, in how that works is this uh, goes back to the idea of hauling buckets versus building a pipeline, which you guys may have already heard something about this before. Um, the story of a woman who lived in a village and her job was to go down to the water source and carry loads and loads of buckets of water up to the village and people would pay her money because that's a lot of work for her to do, right? And, um, and by and by, she started recognizing that if she ever twisted an ankle or had a kid get sick or something like that and wasn't able to haul the buckets that day, she didn't get any income. And she was trading those hours for dollars. And uh, those backbreaking work <laughs> that she knew she wasn't gonna be able to, to maintain forever. But then in addition to that, she also felt like she had a call in her life to do something more valuable, something that, that required the time freedom. So she decided to start building a pipeline. And so any spare moment, money, money she had or moments she had, she began only hauling enough buckets to pay for what she needed to at the time. And then to build this pipeline that over consistent, you know, over, over time, she was able to, um, to have that spigot turn on with fresh water from that water source. And she was still able to get income while providing a good, uh, um, a good value for those friends and family. But the bigger thing was that that pipeline, although it took time to build, um, uh, it was also giving her time freedom. And that's a, a big, big deal. So the way that works and like in terms of what does it look like to build a pipeline? How do you actually make money with doTERRA? Is these four simple steps you sample, teach, enroll, and support. Um, the sampling part just means when when I have a friend who has a really bad headache or who has like seriously bad menstrual cramps and has already, you know, done all the other things and 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 whatnot, um, I get to give them something that I know will help them, and uh, and then I just follow up and find out how much they love it, <laughs> and then they always want to know more. So that's easy to be like, no problem, come on to this class I'm teaching, or you know, jump in on my friend Amanda or Marcella's class that that they're teaching this week. And um, you can learn more about it. It turns out it's super simple. Become part of my community. It's fantastic. And um, yes, yes, they want to enroll. They want to get their own account. They want to be able to know how to do all these things on their own. So that ongoing support where we plug them into the communities and don't leave them floundering with a box full of things that they don't know how to use. Um, and that's it. That's, that's, that's what my life is involved in now. And, um, and the, the beautiful network of people that I am um, growing now is just so much fun. I have more space on my team for other leaders. If this interests you, I hope you guys will reach out and let me know because uh, I would like to show you more and more things about this. So other things besides just money, are, um, I love that I get so many free products. I mean, obviously the loyalty rewards program gets a lot of really great stuff. There's also different incentives and things like that um, for, for helping introduce things to people. And that has been another way that I've gotten a lot of free products as well. Um, now, I know many of you who are watching are moms or, you know, people who are, and many of us don't do such a great job at, at uh, self-care as we should. And improving your health is one of the main ways that, uh, that you will start to see a difference when you begin to make doTERRA not just a, you know, something to make your house smell good or maybe something to help you sleep better, but really use it in this long-term method, like this whole lifestyle change that really improves your health. Now, for me, I already shared with you about how that became a little bit of a, of a, of a mission for me to, to build a community of other moms who can teach others to teach others to feel, really feel courageous and empowered with natural methods. So that has become a little bit of, of my vision. I don't know if that's your matching vision or not, but um, uh, what, whatever the thing is that you feel like you need that freedom um, lifestyle for, it's really becomes so much more able to be reached when doTERRA becomes part of the picture. And then lastly, one of my favorite things is about changing the world. Um, not only does this mean our generational patterns with um, teaching kids at a young age how to use the natural things around them instead of resorting always, always, always to pharmaceuticals. I'm glad they're there, but we don't always need to turn to them as fast as we typically do. 
And, um, but not only that, but on the co-impact sourcing uh, side of things, when you're looking at how, um, how just our, our energy, you know, how the way that a plant is harvested and cared for um, across the world before it becomes an essential oil and makes its way into my home, that makes a difference to me. And I support um, companies like doTERRA who make a big, big effort to be above average and like ideal. In fact, they go way to the like eight times the going rate is, you know, how they're paying a lot of the people who are um, harvesting for them, yet they do not compromise on that purity standard. So if you want more details about that, I can give you more, but um, those are a couple of things that, that thrill me about doTERRA more than just the money. All right. Anything else you wanna share, Masheva? I think that's all I've got for us. Um, are there any questions that people will want answered uh, really quickly on the recording? Otherwise we're going to go ahead and stop the recording and give you guys personalized answers. Oh, all right. Well, thank you. Remember to get your Google form in and remember the cleanse that's coming up if you want that. And remember to let us know if you want a baby class and also diaper rash. I said that so long ago that I'm just going to throw that out there. <laughs> all right. Thank you, everybody.